Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be reviewing um, Outre Synthetic Melted Hairline Lace Front Wig, Sabrina. I have it in the color DR2 slash Cinnamon Spice. This is a ear-to-ear -ear lace, soft Swiss lace, 5 inch deep part, and pre-pluck hairline. You can heat this wig up to 400 degrees. So, let me show you what's inside the wig. This wig comes with three combs, two in the front, one in the back, and has an adjustable straps. And what's amazing about this, it also provides you with an elastic band. The band is ultra soft and is very comfortable, which I seriously love. And as I was trying this on, I couldn't believe how beautiful this wig is. Down to this blown out texture look. Now usually I'm very iffy on blown out texture look because it does make it look pretty poofy. And even here, it is a little poofy. But I decided to alter it just a little, very slightly, by running my hot comb through it. And I will show you guys what the result is after wearing this wig for a week. And if you guys want to keep watching, then stay tuned for the rest of my review. Hey loves, welcome back. And this is the wig of today. Um, I'm just coming back with a final review of this wig. So when I first got the wig, um, I the only thing that I really did to this wig was cut some baby hairs. Um, and then I took my hot comb and went over it a few times just to keep the wig like not too poofy. I'm not used to really big, big hair. Um, I've had blown out texture wigs before and they're always poofy they're a little bit too big for my head and this time I decided to use my um, a hot comb to go over it a few times just to smooth out um, just the top layer um, it, it came out so pretty um, it's really really pretty guys I freaking love not only the style of this wig I love this parting which looks natural um, I like that I did cut off the ear tabs because it definitely gives it that more, um, I don't know, like a, a good natural look. Sorry, my hair is kind of weird the way I just threw it back. But I wore this wig. A lot of people love the color on me. Um, some people thought I dyed my hair. <laughs> um, I will say there is a slight demarcation where the lace is. But I think for the most part, if you use your favorite bronzer, because we always bronze on the edge, outer edge of our um, face, use your bronzer instead of your um, powder foundation. Bronzer will work better because it will hide the demarcation of where the wig is on your forehead. Um, I've learned that tip um, and it helped a lot with a lot of the wigs that I have. Um, because normally I used to put my foundation and the demarcation was there. Girl, you could see it from a mile away. But the, uh, the moment I started using my bronzer, it started working perfectly, beautifully. And you tap the bronzer at the edge and then you can use your whatever foundation you want. But I normally just go in with this um, and it hides and camouflages the demarcation. Um, it's so, so pretty. I really really love the hair it doesn't tangle and I don't know if that's due to me running a hot comb through it a few passes like I didn't like try to like make it silky I just tried to flatten it because I don't like a bulky look but I love when it's like nicely fitted to my head and if it looks like it's natural which it does I love that this is probably my favorite hair I would say texture on me out of a lot of the wigs that I wore just because it feels natural and it doesn't get tang like tangled and it's just styled perfectly like I love the way this wig is styled and I definitely want this wig in black um, I would love to get this wig I think this wig comes in pink I just want a many of the wigs that come in this uh, in this uh, sorry I would like many of, I would love this wig in many colors oh my god what is words and um, if you guys like this on me if you guys have tried it please let me know below what you think um, if you want to let other ladies know like hey go cop that wig because it's bomb or hey this wig had a shedding mess because I haven't had shedding but this is super cute it's so 
pretty. I normally, I think I've had this color once, maybe. I can't think of all the years, but I'm maybe one time, maybe not. I don't know, I'll have to look on my videos to see, but this color is absolutely gorgeous. It's perfect on my head, it's perfect coloring, it's perfect length, it's perfect texture, and I just love it. So, anywho, I give this wig definitely 100% thumbs up. This is probably one of my favorite wigs out of the few that I have done um, so far. I really, really love this wig. It's probably one of my top favorite wigs, if I'm <laughs> just saying is one of my probably my top 10 favorite wigs of all time <laughs> that I wore and I definitely want to get multiples if you see me with multiple colors of a wig it's because I love it it's my favorite it's the best so anyway thumbs up this video and if you guys are new here I love it if you guys subscribe um, I am trying to get content out around work so I do work full-time and I also am trying to open up my own business side business and um, also a family business there's a lot going on and I'm trying to your girl's trying to navigate through COVID, okay? 2020 has been, hmm, 2020 just need to give it one break. Just simmer it down. But I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, loves.